Thulvestrant, Wikipedia Audio Thulvestrant, sold under the brand name Fasladex among others, is a medication used to treat hormone receptor positive metastatic breast cancer in postmenopausal women with disease progression as well as HR positive, HER2 negative advanced breast cancer in combination with palbociclib in women with disease progression after endocrine therapy. It is given by injection into a muscle. Fulvestrant is a selective estrogen receptor degrader and was first in class to be approved. It works by binding to the estrogen receptor and destabilizing it, causing the cell's normal protein degradation processes to destroy it. Fulvestrant was approved for medical use in the United States in 2002. Medical Uses Fulvestrant is used for the treatment of hormone receptor positive metastatic breast cancer or locally advanced unresectable disease in postmenopausal women, it is given by injection. A 2017 Cochrane review found it is as safe and effective as first line or second line endocrine therapy. It is also used to treat HR positive. HER2 negative advanced or metastatic breast cancer in combination with palbociclib in women with disease progression after first-line endocrine therapy. It should not be used in women with kidney failure or who are pregnant. Due to the medication having a similar chemical structure to estrogen, it can interact with immunoassays for blood estradiol concentrations and show falsely elevated results. This can improperly lead to discontinuing the treatment. Very common adverse effects include nausea, injection site reactions, weakness, and elevated transaminases. Common adverse effects include urinary tract infections, hypersensitivity reactions, loss of appetite, headache, blood clots in veins, hot flushes, vomiting, diarrhea elevated bilirubin, rashes, and back pain. Fulvestrant is a selective estrogen receptor degrader. It works by binding to the estrogen receptor and making it more hydrophobic, which makes the receptor unstable and misfold, which in turn leads normal processes inside the cell to degrade it. Fulvestrant is slowly absorbed and maximum plasma concentrations are reached after about 5 days and the terminal half-life is around 50 days. Fulvestrant is highly bound to plasma proteins including very low-density lipoprotein, low-density lipoprotein, and high-density lipoprotein. It appears to be metabolized along the same pathways as endogenous steroids. CYP3A4 may be involved, but non-cytochrome routes appear to be more important. It does not inhibit any CYP450 enzymes. Elimination is almost all via feces. Fulvestrant is a synthetic estrinosteroid and a derivative of estradiol. An alkyl, sulfonyl moiety was added to the endogenous estrogen receptor ligand. Side effects It was discovered through rational drug design, but was selected for further development via phenotypic screening. Fulvestrant was the first selective estrogen receptor degrader to be approved. It was approved in the United States in 2002 and in Europe in 2004. The UK National Institute for Health and Clinical Excellence said in 2011 that it found no evidence Fasladex was significantly better than existing treatments, so its widespread use would not be a good use of resources for the country's National Health Service. The first month's treatment of Fasladex, which starts with a loading dose, costs £1,044.82 and subsequent treatments cost £522.41 a month. In the 12 months ending June 2015, the UK price of a month's supply of anastrozole, 
which is off patent, cost 89 pence slash day, and letrozole cost pound 1.40 slash day. The original patent for Faslidex expired in October 2004. Drugs subject to pre-marketing regulatory review are eligible for patent extension, and for this reason AstraZeneca got an extension of the patent to December 2011. AstraZeneca has filed later patents. There is no generic Faslidex available. A later patent for Faslidex expires in January 2021. Atossa Genetics has a patent for the administration of fulvestrant into the breast via a microcatheter invented by Susan Love. Fulvestrant was studied in endometrial cancer but results were not promising and as of 2016 development for this use was abandoned. Because fulvestrant cannot be given orally, Efforts have been made to develop SERD drugs that can be taken by mouth, including brylanistrant and elacistrant. The clinical success of fulvestrant also led to efforts to discover and develop a parallel drug class of selective androgen receptor degraders. Pharmacology Chemistry History Society and Culture Nice evaluation. Patent extension. Research. <laughs>